The woman with the issue of blood, the blind beggar, the man on a mat who was lowered before the master. These are just some of the many biblical examples of people who experienced the healing touch of Jesus. And whithersoever he entered into villages or cities or country, they laid the sick in the streets and besought him that they might touch, if it were, but the border of his garment. And as many as touched him were made whole. That's Mark chapter 6, verse 56. I love the way the scripture words that. As many as touched him were made whole. And the wonderful reality is that Jesus still heals. Nowhere in all of the scripture does it teach that Jesus has stopped working miracles. Everything that Jesus was anointed to do well here on earth, the Holy Spirit continues to do for and through us. I've seen it with my own eyes, miracles of healing. The blind see, the deaf hear, the mute speak, the paralyzed move, and the afflicted are set free from their pain. Years of suffering, seasons of pain can all come to an end. I recall one instance in particular. A little girl attended one of my services with her mother. The girl had developed crooked legs. Her legs were turned inward. That little girl and her mother came to the service believing for a miracle. They came early but could only find seats in the very back of the building. Nevertheless, they persisted in faith, knowing that God's healing touch could reach them even where they were. During the worship, they began to believe for the miracle to take place, for the little girl's legs to straighten. Though nothing happened immediately, the little girl insisted that Jesus would heal her. After the service had ended, they began to drive home. The miracle had yet to transpire. But sitting there in the car, that little girl held on to hope. Suddenly, the girl began to hear a popping sound. She remarked to her mother, Mom, do you hear that? Something is popping like popcorn. They didn't know it until the next morning, but that girl's legs had become perfectly straight. To their joy and amazement, the miracle had happened. A miracle can instantaneously turn any situation around. The lesson to be learned is one of simple faith. Don't worry, only believe. And keep believing because any moment can be your miracle moment. There's no trick to it. There's no formula, no method, no special approach. It's just the healing power of God meeting simple faith. So reach out in faith and touch Him. All it takes is a single touch from the hand of Jesus to make you whole. That same mighty power which flowed through the very body of Jesus, that same healing virtue still rushes like a river today. Jump into the river of healing. Be encouraged yesterday, today, and forever. Our Jesus, the Jesus of the Bible, is a healing Jesus. I'm David Diga Hernandez, and that is your Moment of Truth. For more free teachings like this, make sure you're signed up to my emailing list so that I can send you weekly emails with content that will help you to grow spiritually. Go to davidhernandezministries.com slash email. Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.